Hello beautiful souls, welcome to my channel. This is your favorite fortune teller Divine Light. I'm wishing you all a happy new year. Hope you enjoy your new year's eve with your loved ones and your family and or by yourself, just enjoying yourself. And I'm going to do a general coffee cup reading which is going to be for January 2023 and this is going to be for the first week. Hope you enjoy it. Don't forget to give it a like and if you like to see more, please subscribe to my channel. Alright, well, let's get into it now. Okay, as you can see the cup was holding. So this means that if you had like a desire, a wish in your mind, it is going to happen really soon. Okay. I see here right out the bat, actually this is coming up to towards the end of the week we can say or maybe the month. There are like four different paths are opening up for you. And these are like beautiful, bright and like wonderful paths. And I see like one, two and three phone calls that those phone calls or emails, like some sort of like a communication lines you're going to have. And right here, actually, there's like a bird. This bird is going to bring you this news, whatever is like happening. End of the January, end of the first week, you're going to get the signs of it. In the beginning of the week you're gonna get like some signs and like there's like a big bird here actually this looks like an eagle to me um eagle represent like power strength and freedom so this is going to be like you're gonna get some signs of this news and the path the roads that you're traveling in the beginning of this month and this is going to be actually uh representing like freedom for you whatever this thing is in your heart i see like a, a little uh, actually like feels like this looks like a heart but it's like a half heart so it feels like um if you are going through maybe um stressful time and or if you have like you're tr trying to start a relationship with someone or like you don't have like a half communication, maybe it's not, everything is not clear about relationships or like a heart matters. So this is going to start clearing out like towards the mid, middle of the month or maybe end of the month. The things are gonna start to clear out and this is like a romantic thing, like the heart is like starting to appear. So if you have somebody that you're expecting to get in touch with you, which they didn't, they're gonna start to communicate with you eventually. And like that darkness that in your heart, that the worry, anxiety, is going to start to fade away. Let's see what's happening after, like in the, within the first period of the week. So I usually divide the cup into four. So you can like uh, see this, like the first couple of weeks and first couple of days and this, the later days and divide it that way. So this is going around the, like it's like a clock. I divide it up and you can interpret that by the days. So after that, I see like um, there's a struggle here. I see one, two, three, four people like they feel like they're falling off a cliff. And I see like a male figure here who has like a cape. Somebody's trying to save all of these people. Like they're trying to hold on to all of these people, but he's like holding on to two of them. And the rest is like falling down and one of them is like falling down the hill so this might be maybe like a financial thing just i just occurred to me but this might be also a family issue like uh, if you have like a family of four maybe somebody is like um is not really very uh, helpful in the family and uh, or maybe they put themselves in a situation that is really tough and one of them is going to fall out, meaning like they're probably going to just find a way to handle themselves because they're not really falling to a bad place because this is like a white, bright place. And then somebody else is standing up, like holding them. They're creating a net to catch them, even though like maybe if you have like a family member that you couldn't able to help, uh, they're going to receive help, but you're not going to be able to help them. You're not going to be the one just holding them and moving forward like you might receive the news that somebody's going through a hard time and you're not going to be able to give them a hand because you're giving hand to other people but they're going to be okay because they're going to be held by 
uh, hold by somebody else. Somebody else is gonna catch them in that situation. Following that, I see like a little snake here. This might indicate a little health issue. This actually seems like a cross to me. Like you might have maybe like um, um, some religious religion related thing happening in your life. And like I see like a lot of people coming towards you. So like you might have like a religious travel maybe. It just occurred to me. And uh, or this also looks like a man standing and like feeding birds like he has like seeds in his hand and, and just throwing. So this might be someone religious in your life helping likes to help out people, which is going to bring more people to help or they're going to help you out. And there's going to be like a synergy created with this man. He's going to attract more people and um this is going to create abundance because like giving creates more abundance. This is what he is creating right now. And I see like the snake indicates the health thing. So, but this is bright and clear. So if you have been going through like a health issue, it's going to clear out. It's going to start to evolve. And like this snake is like straightening out. As you can see here, it's just becoming straight. So it's everything is going to be okay. And I see like a man's face here. This looks like a little cartoonish actually. Like holding a um, candle or like uh, we can say a candle or like a torch. Like this might be uh, like he has a snake on top of his head. This might be the person who has health problems or this might be the solution to these health problems. Like you might find a very effective doctor who's going to give you a hand so you can be like cleared of this health thing that you're going through. I also see like a lady here, like a, um, she's a little feeling a little upset and she's also holding a candle. I feel like she's like a burning a candle maybe in the church or something. Like she's praying for you to get better and you will be getting better. Also, I see like a paper, white paper here this indicates like some sort of legal accomplishments so maybe with this health related issue getting fixed is going to bring you something a legal accomplishment with that and um i also see like a heart here this looks like a heart shape and somebody is standing on top of this heart this person has like a wearing like a cape maybe like a hoodie and like ha doesn't really have any uh, facial features appeared yet so this might be someone that you're manifesting and they have like you in their mind as well this might be like a masculine figure or a feminine figure because they're not really clear and they are actually manifesting you too as you can see like in their mind you're right here as well be so uh, this person has like a candle a torch in their hand and also a tulip tulips are very strong uh flowers they bloom right after winter and like um they are the bringer of spring so if you have been manifesting like a relationship that you want to live the spring with that with this person this is going to happen like you're going to get signs of it like because this is not 100 percent clear and i also see like birds here so you might actually get news like somebody might tell you like they know someone that can be suitable for you that can be the like that can be the beginning of this thing later after that i see like another paper here so this is another legal accomplishment you might be getting and i see like silhouette of humans here so this might be actually like you are expecting this someone to approve this so these people are going to approve this thing for you so you can have this accomplishment i also see a male figure here wearing a hat and having a conversation with another person who's wearing a cape here so like there are two people in power in position in higher positions are discussing something so they can actually they're talking about somebody they're behind them or maybe this is like a magic wand they're going to hand you over the magic wand they're discussing that this might be like a workplace or some people like you know or maybe you don't know they're discussing that and like you can see the bright silhouette here a person that they're talking about and they're going to give this person the magic wand that whatever that person is desiring that power and strength they're gonna get it and i see like an ostrich here as well ostrich as you can know they're such fast animals strong and like powerful and they have like they hatch this huge egg so 
like this is like a, this might be your power animal which is going to bring you in this new year this new beginning and this power and strength that you have been actually manifesting for a long time this is actually an indication for that and as i mentioned in the beginning like towards the end of the week and the month you might be traveling four different paths and i see like a lot of dinosaurs here like dinosaur type of shapes and this might be the cities they're ancient places that you're going to maybe like um, um somewhere in greece or in italy or like some like there are probably ancient places in United States or in other countries. So you're probably traveling to those, those kind of places. That's, those are like the signifying, um, like uh, signifiers of those places. All right, guys, if you have a question, a desire, an intention, just hold it in your mind and let's see what the oopsie answer is going to be for that. I see you getting like a big... Um, this looks like wealth to me, but this might be also something else. And your desire is going to come to you really fast. It doesn't really have any time left, as you can see. It's going to happen really fast. Like throughout this month, you'll be receiving um, financial... Like this also looks like to me the snake eating its own tail. This snake eating its own tail is like a... a coming full circle it's like a new beginning this also represents the the world card in tarot so the world card is like happy endings new beginnings everything is like going to uh like finalizing in the best way possible let me find that card i don't really have um that okay this is it and this also reminded me of the king of wands. He has like salamanders eating their own tails as well. So this might be related to someone, a fire sign. And I see like a male figure standing right here. Male figures. Um, this king of wands is a fire sign. Uh, Leo, Sagittarius or Aries. So this might be someone within that um, um, horoscope. So coming into your life. Also this world card as you can see she's like having uh she has her balance she has her like wands in her hand it's a new beginning for her everything is going great so this might be a signifier of that for this month you're going to start having things in your life like new beginnings are coming and the old cycles are coming to an end and um the things are going to start working for you really fast within the month i see here actually there's another person standing like a bit, feeling bitter with a cloak so they're walking out of your life and this new person is like walking in and i see two people like having a little conversation but this is not something romantic i feel like if you have like a masculine or a feminine figure in your life uh, like if you're a woman like the masculine figure if you're a man you're a feminine figure you're gonna have like a conversation this person might be a sister a mother or someone that you see that way in the beginning of the month which is going to open the doors for you for this like new beginning everything is going to start to fall into place i also have the whale here so this is also another financial um, abundance coming into your life within this month all right guys that's all for today hope you enjoyed this reading if you do don't forget to give it a like and Subscribe for more and have a happy new year. Bye.